Hi guys, well it's Monday night, um, haven't had a video for a while, this is just a quick one to see if I can still do it, I really had flu in bed for a couple of days, but uh, we should manage to get through. Um, just adjusting up some micrometers and setting them, uh, this one I've had for a little while, it's come up to me with me in to Queensland in oh gosh seven years ago or so um, it's not seen a lot of use since then but it was the one that I brought with me it's a Starrett and I guess it's a little bit unusual I'm not sure if anyone's seen one it's a number 220 it's in pretty good condition but really not sure how old it is it's missing one anvil and it always has done. If anyone's got a spare anvil for it, I'd be very grateful. But that's a long shot. It's the Starrett not to one The 220 is the... There we go. It's a 220FL. Um, it's the interchangeable anvil one. This slips out. And you use this to measure tube thicknesses, which is <clears throat> quite a useful thing to have. And uh, probably be used to measure screw thread depths too, compare them. It's very handy for measuring the inside of a curved surface, like a um, a tankard or a a bowl, something that needs to be engraved. I can guess nowadays, but uh, that was the reason I brought it with me, and it got used for that sort of work for for a bit. But that's the Starrett two twenty. It's a, a friction thimble micrometer and they're a bit hard to adjust. It's got its own little spanner there. Which is there. And you've got to unscrew it completely out and adjust it a bit and unscrew it back in. So it's a slow process. But it's just one of my little treasures and I thought I'd show that off and... Maybe no one's really seen one. It is a fairly unusual micrometer, I think. But it's a useful thing. And <coughs> it's only graduated thousandths of an inch. I think they were made in ten thousandths of an inch mic, in ten thousandths of an inch calibration. But the website, Starrett's website, says. Um, we're not really up for selling you that because they haven't got the accuracy. Now, I've never ever been able to fault it. Um, it's a Starrett micrometer. It's really it's close enough. Uh, it's a lot closer than than I'll ever have to be. So, just thought you might like to see that. I've been cleaning the bench up a bit, and I had hoped to do lots of videos and have a few put away for later I've got a week off so um, hopefully that'll still happen but <coughs> the last <coughs> excuse me the last few days <coughs> have been spent in bed with chicken soup so um, we'll see how we go <laughs> thanks for watching guys and don't forget to to, to like the video and to um, comment if you've got any comments about this and um, subscribe to my channel. Thanks, guys.